Broadcasting live from the Vile Stadium in San Francisco, home of the 40 Nightmares. You know why this team is named that? Because their fans are known to wake up in a cold sweat screaming at the top of their lungs. <laughs> I don't blame them. Don't poke fun at their city, Grim. Plenty of great places to eat if you like vegan. Hey, I love to eat vegan, but they always whine when you're cooking them. Remember, in the NFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitro here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all you can eat horse shit buffets on the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. shots like that over your career? Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And this field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. Officially sanctioned NFL rule. <laughs> and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. position in football, the mighty punter. Apparently the punter for the day is being played by my kid's sister, and she doesn't have legs. And he just lets that one go. He says, oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. <laughs> and it's first and ten.
First and ten. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Second down, and he... Oh, and the defense jumps offside to the tackle the QB. This guy can talk before he died. What do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! Second down and two. in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> for a first down. And it's first and ten. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Run. 
Second down and seven. Rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. They let the punt drop and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. four more downs to punish the defense and you better believe they will and it's first and ten and with a burst of speed he finds an opening and the first down and it's first and ten and that's a great nine yard completion there hey it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains and that'll bring up second and one hot one hot two Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Stumbling, he could go all the way. Four yards 
on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Two minutes remain in the half. Wait! I gotta take a dump! Again? You just went. How is that even possible? Ah, it's the nachos, man! Want some? was stalled and here comes the field goal attempt. Second 
quarter. Seven will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. We're back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalpost if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistake, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. And it's first and ten. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. And that's how you run the football. First and ten. should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. First and ten. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. And they take the line and he gets his bell run for a yard. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. First down. This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think he knows what a first down is. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. Try hurling those traps next time. Close, but no cigar. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. Second down and four. Yo, man, nobody 
Once you touch one eyeball, I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down, and the punter is warming up. And he's off to the races. He's running out of gas now. The 20. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and 10. for a touchdown. Don't make any mistakes here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. That kick is good. is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. Higher to the quarterback, tight spirals, and you know, if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying... Psycho killer. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Nah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. Offense says it's time to put the rep out of his misery. so hard I went into a dark tunnel thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the line turns out it was just the visitors tunnel that he knocked me into and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face oh and that's how you play defense of course he he could have had an interception returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game but I don't want to nitpick boring but smart time to punt whoa whoa you can't say that on the radio and he booted a high arcing rainbow they just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. You know this dirty. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. A two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck up. That was just a one time thing.
point attempt. I don't see a chance in hell in here. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. You've got to catch that. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. down and it's first and ten and he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive and it's first and ten oh and did he just put on a display there touchdown Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The onside kick's a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a position. Stealing ain't right, Glenn. It just ain't right. Defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. And it's first and ten. Pow! And the defense calls Thunderclap. The offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me. You ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. First down and three. Two-yard run before he stopped. Second down and two. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. And this rep is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Baby, 
I'm the greatest. No, you didn't snatch them too fast. <laughs> Field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Briggs. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. <laughs> and the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. First and ten. <laughs> Holy crap! He runs straight into a mutant trap and dies! Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. Oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Better shot. First and ten. Foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Man, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. Signals for a hurry up offense. Hey, we want the hurry up offense. There's no huddle. The offense talks. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. Not to mention my kneecaps. My long shot is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. Two minutes left in the game. Thank God I gotta take a wicked dump. Feel like I'm sitting on a wax candle. Not on my shoulder, you know. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. And he takes a break from conquering and vaporizing other civilizations to score six points. He's such a driven player. You gotta give him credit. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? And then, my friends, is why the world hates kickers. I kind of feel sorry for him. The kicker's going to have to kick the ball just right so his team can recover it. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And it's first and ten. Right rage ignites that deep down violent rage and... Oh, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can... 
and put their players on the bench. First down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. Save some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. Either way, they're going for two. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. You can't take them into the locker room, so you might as well use them now. Why would you want to take a timeout into the locker room, Grim? That doesn't sound right. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Shave a few days off his life. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. San Francisco 40 Nightmares have won the game in front of their hometown fans. And the stadium is screaming like a kid's party at Chuck E. Cheesy. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. I was in scrambled tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -hmm. Good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.